My name is Catherine Fior. I'm the Vice President Marketing and a Director with Adroit Resources. Adroit Resources is a TSXV and FSE listed junior company. We have properties in Canada and Italy and those properties are 100% owned. Today I'm going to be focusing on our Italian properties and the strategic metal of, that is antimony. Uh, we have approximately 45,000 tonnes in historic resources that we want to make compliant with the 43101 instrument. And we are confident that we can extend this to over 100,000 tonnes. Timony is a very widely spread, widely used industrial metal. It's used in plastics, it's used to make flame retardants. You find it in some very key emerging technologies, iPads, semiconductors, photovoltaic cells. So there is a very strong demand and need for the metal. But there's also a growing problem with supply. China currently dominates the market with over 90% of world production. In, at the end of 2010, quantitative restrictions were introduced and import subsidies were introduced for this metal in 2011. More recently, the British Geological Survey have placed this at their at highest risk list. So I'll be talking about antimony and why I believe and why the British Geological Survey believe it is one of the elements that it is greatest risk. One reason that I like to come to the Objective Capital Conferences is that um, I personally get exposed to uh, topics that I wouldn't normally hear when I'm in Canada. I just came back from uh, Adroit Resources uh, talk presentation given by Catherine Fiora on antimony and uh, one thing that was quite intriguing is the similarities between the, the antimony market um, and the rare earths. Uh, similar volumes sold uh, globally and the fact that China uh, to date has a lock on those materials but is starting to run out of them so that uh, there is a focus now on developing antimony resources outside of China and uh, for me it was interesting because I didn't know much about antimony uh, so it was uh, very very enlightening to uh, hear Catherine's talk. Can I just draw your attention to this first slide? This is a picture of mining in Italy. Now we have a great deal of difficulty persuading investors that you are allowed to mine in Italy. This is Grosseto province. There are 577 working mines and there are 38 geothermal power stations. So can I assure you that you are allowed to dig a hole in the ground in Italy? This is just a disclaimer um, to cover uh, forward-looking statements uh, about what we think or what we estimate is going to happen, it's going to happen for Detroit over the next couple of years. I'm going to cover the capital structure of Adroit, our two flagship assets. I'm going to concentrate on our uh, Italian properties because those are the ones that uh, have our historic antimony resource. 